hello my beautiful butterflies and welcome back to my channel today's video i'm going to share with you an unboxing from hermes so if you want to see what that's all about you guys you know what to do just keep right on watching okay you guys so today's video is going to be an unboxing from hermes but you know the drill before we get into any of that let's do a little bit of housekeeping just in case you're interested so as always starting with my face today you guys i am wearing a new palette i picked up that i am pleasantly surprised with and it's by patrick stars line called one size they actually had this palette on Sephora on sale um, recently and it's probably still on sale at this moment. So I decided to pick it up and oh boy am I glad I did you guys because I love it. So let me just show you what it looks like. So here's what the palette looks like you guys. I first went over my entire lid with this shade right here called mango and so this shade is like my skin tone and it acts like a transition shade for me and then i went in my crease area with this shade right here called book and then i went on my outer v right here with this shade called brownie on my lid is this beautiful shimmery shade right here called everything and it is everything so beautiful and then on my brow bone i use this shade right here called vanilla sand you guys this was an amazing palette to use i am so happy i picked it up on sale at sephora I can't wait to play around with some of the other colors, especially this blue and green here. I bet will be so, so beautiful. I was pleasantly surprised about the formulation of this palette. And then also, I love that it's one of those one and done palettes. Every shade that you would need to perform an eyeshadow look is in this palette. So you would have like your brow bone, you would have your transition, you would have your crease, you can have your outer V. It has that black in it in case you want to deepen it some more. And then all the other colors are just like bonus colors, you guys. So again, I am so happy that I picked up this palette. This color right here, everything is such a beautiful color. It is a shimmer, so it does have a little bit of fallout, but that's to be expected whenever you're using shimmers or glitters, you're gonna get some fallout from them. But, you know, I just took my finger, packed it on, and it was just beautiful, you guys. So, I am pleasantly surprised with this, and I'm so glad I picked this up. And then next, you guys, on my eyes today, I have this mascara that I picked up from the Sephora sale by YSL. I'm loving this mascara already. I used it for the first time today, and I love the fact that it has given my lashes some length, you guys. You know, I love a mascara to do that. I love volume when it comes to my lashes because, again, I don't particularly put on falsies. So, I love this YSL one, and I'm so glad I picked that up from that Sephora sale and was able to save 20% off of this. It is so well worth it. And hopefully you can see that right there. So that's what's on my eyes today. And then on my cheeks today is another one of Patrick Starr's palettes here. This is one of his trios in Very That. So this is the cheek clappers here. And if you're familiar with them, they come with the three products in it. So you have a cream base, you have your blush, and you have your highlight. So I'm just wearing the blush and the highlight today on my cheeks. My first purchase um, from this one size line was the cheek 
clapper and a concealer and both items I was presently surprised with so when I was on Sephora and saw the eyeshadow palette on sale I was just like let me pick that up and try it out and I love them you guys I love these products so if you haven't tried some of Patrick Starr's products I say check them out at Sephora you guys I absolutely love them so that's what I have on my face today and then next as for my lips today you guys I am wearing this lip gloss from Sicily it's in shade number two Aurora and that is what Aurora looks like right there is such a beautiful shade with some hints of glitter in there and it's like a pinkish color and it's so so beautiful so I have that on from Sicily and so next you guys as a fragrance today I'm wearing one from Louis Vuitton that I love to wear during the spring summer this scent you guys is one of those ones that I call my whimsical scent it is so playful and fun and girly. This fragrance is Herb Sea Absence. And you guys, if you have not checked this out from Louis Vuitton, I say go in there and get a sample. It is such a beautiful, fun fragrance. And if you're into those type of fragrances where it's just like, just whimsical, you guys, check this one out I definitely love it and that is what I'm wearing today okay you guys so I just had to take a quick break because I noticed when I went to share with you what earrings I had on I had on no earrings so if you see the first part of this video I have no earrings on just until now I just realized when I went to do my ear like this to share with you what earrings I had on I didn't have any on so I just popped some on for you guys and I am wearing my LV studs, iconic studs right here from Louis Vuitton. So yeah, that's what my earrings are today. And then next on my neck today, I have my T necklace on, which is a double necklace from Nordstrom Rack. And then I have on my LV bracelet right here and this one is called the fasten me bracelet so it just buckles in the front there and then as for the top I'm wearing today I just hauled this one in my last video I picked it up from Burlington very inexpensive I think it was only like $10.99 for the top it's one of those like three-quarter lengths tops but it's one of those nice like airy ones and I really really love the way this fit and I'm just wearing the top with a pair of shorts and then next for my bag of the day I am still rocking my Longchamp La Pliage backpack here and I've had this since the weekend you guys I had everything packed in here for my overnight stay with my daughter at the hospital. So I had all my snacks and everything in here um, for the delivery of my grandchild. So that is the bag that I'm rocking today. So that does it for housekeeping today. And before we get into the unboxing, I want to give a huge thank you to all of you out there who wished me a congratulations on the birth of my new grandson. You guys, he's so adorable. And thank you so, so much for all your congratulations and well wishes. My daughter and the baby are home now and they're doing just great, you guys. And I really, really thank you for taking your time to congratulate us I'm actually on my way there because I can't stay away already on my way over there after I do this video and yeah I'm gonna take her other son with me he's actually here with grandma so I'm keeping him for at least a week or or two weeks 
somewhere around there so you know she can get acclimated with a new baby and get to moving around and back to her normal routine and then I'll take them back home and so we'll keep going over there every so often to check on the family so yeah I'm headed over there after um, the video here and I'll insert a clip of my little new grandbaby just in case you haven't seen him so you guys let's get into this quick unboxing and my unboxing today comes from the house of Hermes and so I am not going to prolong this anymore I'm going to open this box, you guys, and share what's inside of it. So, let's get into this unboxing, you guys. And I always love their packaging. They have such beautiful packaging. There it is. And this is how it came right here and so as you can see these are shoes so you guys i love that each of the shoes come in its own little dust bag and i picked up any guesses i picked up these beautiful hermes sandals here and so as you can see, these are the Oran sandals here. And I got them in the black calf skin right here. And they're in the size 38. And here is the other one right here. Now I did want these shoes right here in two colors. I actually wanted them in three colors, I'll be honest with you. But the tan one or the Hermes Gold, which is the brown tannish looking one. So I'm undecided about that one right now because when I tried it on, it was a little bit underwhelming on my um, foot. I felt when I looked down only because that tan was, it kind of looked blend not blended into my skin tone but it just didn't give it a pop if you understand what i'm talking about so i have that problem sometimes with nude shoes it's like okay it looks like i'm not wearing a shoe <laughs> but yeah so i'm undecided about that one i've seen so many colors that i like so i know this won't be my last pair of these shoes i love the way these looked and feel so I just want to see if the calf skin will, you know, stretch like he said it would. And I'm pretty sure it would. Um, and yeah, I know I'm going to probably pick up a white pair. Because I definitely like the white one on my foot as well. And they had this beautiful green as well. So yeah, I'm just not decided on what other colors I will get. I know white is one of the other ones that's on my radar. So I probably will get that white. Um, but for now, you guys, I got this beautiful black pair that, you know, I'm going to choose black first anyway because it just simply goes with everything and I love a nice black shoe. That's just me. So yeah, I picked these up. So to be continued, I will tell you, you know, if they stretch as like he said as well. Um, so that's what I'm waiting to find out. And if they don't, I will go with the 38 and a half. But he said the calf skin definitely stretches. So, so definitely, you know, I'm going to see how this works out for me. And I will definitely be, you know, shopping to get me some other colors. Because again, I love the way these feel. So, the Oran sandals weren't the first 
um, sandal that I wanted from Hermes. I actually went in there looking for another sandal that was completely sold out in the U.S. Um, they were called the Cypri um, sandal and they're like the dad looking sandals. So they're Hermes' version of a dad sandal. And you know I'm all about comfort. So that was the first pair I initially wanted. But again they were sold out so I end up trying these on and taking these home. But you guys. I'm still on a hunt for those sandals, so hopefully they'll come back in stock where I can purchase them. I guess, you know, they're the hot thing at the moment. But yeah, that one I am interested in as well, so hopefully I can get my hands on a pair of those. But um, yeah, so, oh, before I leave, my Crocs, my other Crocs came in too. So these were the other pair. I showed you the pink pair in my last haul, but these were the other two colors that was on sale for $22.49 on the Croc website that I was waiting to come in. So I got this black colorful one and then a basic white one. So yeah, I have these for comfort for now. But I definitely would love those dad sandals. So, you guys, that is it for today. I want to thank you so, so very much for always tuning into my channel and commenting on my channel. And you guys, let me just say, sometimes I don't get to your comments right away. But trust me, I will get there at some point um, and respond back to all of you. So hopefully you won't get frustrated with that. I do love to read each and every comment and comment back to you guys. So it's just not done sometimes right away. But I always read your comments and eventually I will always respond to them. So thank you for your patience with that. And if you have not subscribed to my channel and you want to become part of my beautiful butterfly family, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each and every time T uploads her video for you. And as always, you guys, thank you so, so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.